Hi and welcome to this video. This is just going to be a quick video uh, introducing Otto to the world. Now you may or may have not seen but Vagrant has a successor uh, as stated on the website and basically it's by the same company, it's by HashiCorp and the software is called Otto. And uh, you can see on the website that their tagline is development and deployment made easy. So essentially um, Whereas Vagrant was supposed to be easy for setting up de uh, development environments on your local machine, Otto plans to do it all. So there'll be a development process, there'll be um, the production process, and it's also got intelligent things like it tries to install dependencies or packages related to your project and the software you'll be using. So it sounds really, really exciting. And, um, you know, I'd, I'd really ask you to have a look on the website. It's autoproject.io. It's a really, really well-designed website. And I just go through it, have a look, see what you think. And um, stay tuned. I'm going to have a few videos discussing how to use Otto, um, the use cases for it, that kind of thing. So as you can see here, they've actually done a very, very simple use case on the website, which is Rails on AWS, so Amazon Web Services. So as you can see, it's very, very simple. To start your Rails project, you run the Rails command, which is Rails new, and then for Otto's command will be Otto compile. You run Otto dev to develop locally. And also another part of Otto which really excites me is the infrastructure side. And you run, it's another single command, Otto infra, which runs the infrastructure for you. You can then build your application with the Otto build command when ready and deploy with Otto deploy. And it's that simple. Your application is online, ready to go. Obviously, you will want to code something and add a database here or what have you, but you can see how easy it is. So, yeah, I'm really excited about this. Get yourself over to the website. Have a look, see what you think. Now, this doesn't mean that Vagrant is over. This doesn't mean, you know, that you have to stop using Vagrant. If you are happy with Vagrant, then, then use it. But... I would recommend giving Otto a try. If you don't like it, if it's not for you or it doesn't fit your requirements, then stay with Vagrant or stay with another type of software if you are. So thank you very much for watching and watch this space. Thank you. Bye-bye.